Hey guys, just a still image here, but I just wanted to remind you all, um, it's 10 days until Final Space is gone. From Netflix, anyways. I've started rewatching it again. I'm probably going to try and run through it one more time before it goes. Uh, just so sad to see this go. Owen Rogers did a video about, uh, about 15 days ago talking about how it was going to be gone. And I didn't mean to do this earlier, uh, but I was just so caught up with work. But yeah, it's it's sad. I'm, I'm really sad that this is something that's become a thing. I, I have missed out on having this unfortunate circumstance happen to me, but I do know that has happened to a few other people, especially a lot of recent projects. Uh, one that I can think of is that uh, Grease, the pink girls, the pink ladies one. Whether you thought the show was good or not, it is erased from existence. Paramount is not even streaming it. There is no physical means, if I'm correct, to get that. And just to imagine having worked on something that has no actual legal means of existence is awful. Final Space had a physical release of the first season, and that was it. Um, it's impossible to find. You can't find it anywhere, except maybe on eBay. Um, but there wasn't one for the third season, and I don't believe there was one for the second season. Thankfully, thankfully, uh, he has been given the permission from TBS and whatnot to make a graphic novel that will finish the last two seasons. So that's going to be great. But the problem is, you're still going to have to go about rather means of seeing the original three seasons because TBS and Warner Brothers and whatnot they have no intention of releasing any physical version of this not that they have said there is going to be no physical version of this and that is just depressing because Olin did a lot of great work there were a ton of great cast in that show Ron Perlman uh, well, I don't remember her name, but the one from Farscape, uh, uh, Steven Yun, um, Conan O'Brien, uh, Keith David. There were a lot of big names in this, and now it's, it's, it's gone. It's going to be gone. So, if you don't have it, and I'm also talking from Canadian Netflix, so I don't know if it's the same for American Netflix. I don't know if it's gone there already. But if you have the chance, watch it. At least watch the first season. Um, that's still the best season, in my opinion. I think that was the show at its best. Season two went a little long, but it was still funny. And season three really started to get the end game, the whole main plot really going which was then unfortunate with how it ends on a really big cliffhanger <laughs> so but if if you were to watch anything i would say watch the first season because just on its own it's a good first season but anyways i just wanted to say that to you guys i just wanted to let you know uh, just watch it if you can Thankfully, I know I'll still have means of being able to watch it, but the fact that I can't have a physical copy of it, at least to my knowledge, is very unfortunate because this show deserved a lot better. Anyways, guys, that's all for me. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like, and please, just go and watch it. Go and watch it one last time if you can. I know Olin would appreciate that. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later.